the 030 release of the uh, CICD Assets VS Code extension uh, actually only provided one uh, new piece of functionality, and that was the ability to download uh, a Dependabot uh, config file. So in the same way that we can download uh, multiple different files into our uh, uh, workspace now, the new one that got added was this uh, Dependabot config file. So if I go ahead and click on that, we'll see this new folder be created because that's the convention that Dependabot uses. And in there, we'll find a config.yaml file. And that has uh, my uh, information that, that my, uh, what I want to have as part of my Dependabot setup. Uh, so again, if you wanted to, uh, obviously you're not going to want my configuration, but it is possible within the settings of uh, this extension to have that point at a different URL that you could uh, provide to download your uh, Dependabot configuration and put it into your, this folder. Uh, so that's really the only thing that got added to this uh, release. The other one, uh, the other uh, issues that you'll see within the release notes here were really uh, uh, maintenance things that need to be done. So there's a couple of security releases uh, to bump some of the uh, uh, dependencies that I take uh, when I'm actually creating this uh, creating this uh, Visual Studio Code extension. Uh, so these were generated by Dependabot, uh, thankfully, uh, and it keeps me up to date with uh, when upstream changes have come into place. Uh, and the other one here is uh, I switched to using uh, my new recipe uh, convention, my new recipe uh, scripts, uh, specifically for uh, building VS Code extensions. So rather than having the same set of uh, build scripts in, uh, I think it's now four different repositories, uh, I centralize that into a, a recipe that I can use whenever I'm creating a VS Code extension now. Uh, so those items were uh, maintenance uh, related, uh, no new functionality there, uh, but just one of those things that needs to get done. Uh, so hopefully, this, again, hopefully this new uh, command is of use. Uh, if not, uh, feel free to let, uh, reach out and tell me. Uh, and if there's anything you think needs to add to this extension, again, feel free to reach out. Thank you very much.